Hey guys, Tech Manager with a video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to lock your iPhone on a specific screen or photo if you're going to be using to trace for drawing. And you can do the same exact step on iPhone or iPad. And I'll show you how you can do that. So let's get started. So on the latest iOS version, what you'll do is open up your settings. And once you open up settings, you want to find accessibility now if you don't see accessibility here it's also under general sometimes with an older version so click on accessibility and go all the way down here with this guided access and you click on that and you turn on guided access and once you do that you also want to want to turn on this accessibility shortcut which allows you to activate it once you triple click on this side button so once you have that set up we're ready to go and the other thing to keep in mind when you're using this is you need to ensure under accessibility under touch your assistive touch is turned off and all of this should be just none for these three actions and any top level should you should not touch any of those just keep it as is but turn this off and after that we're ready to lock our phone for tracing so find your app or your photo that you like to maybe trace and open it up I'll open up a photo for example right I want this to be locked so I can maybe trace it for drawing all I do is simply click on this side button about four or three times just one after another one two so you have to do it quick so it's one two three and this guided access will pop up if you click on once it will just lock the phone so make sure you press the three really quick and then once you get this option for guided access you click on options and you want to turn off touch and pretty much anything else as well in motion all of these should be turned off so then hit done and then start and then you want to put a passcode so you can exit out of it it's important that you remember this passcode may be the same as your Apple uh, pass code for your phone but it could be a different one as well so I just took something really simple to that way I because I'm just tracing, I can just get out if I need to. So after that, it says guided access has started. Now, as you can see here, if I touch this, do something, I draw, put a paper, pen, or whatever it is, right, on top of this, it will not do anything for it. As you can see here, it will not move it, so I can now trace this photo just like that. So we can go ahead and trace it. And then also for rotation, if you want to turn off rotation, you can also do that. So to exit out of it, you also want to do a triple click on this so to get exit out of guided access you click on this button three times one two three make sure you do it exactly like right after another because if you don't it'll be stuck so I'll do one two three and as you can see here triple click to exit so one two three and after that we will get this prompt and then we will simply enter the passcode and now we're exit we can end the session here just like that and our guided access has ended the other thing I mentioned about rotation if you want rotation turn off pull down the menu or from the top the control center make sure you put on the rotation lock so that it doesn't rotate for you when you're in guided access so that's one thing to keep in mind again that's simple as that. I'll make sure the triple click is probably the most important one. It has to be really quick, like one, two, three. Like if you don't do that quick enough, you'll find that it's harder to work with it. So make sure you press the three buttons exactly the same time and then you can exit in and out of this and then end it whenever you're ready to end it. So that's how you do it. So I hope this video was helpful. If so, please make the like and subscribe button. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.